Hello and welcome to our new home. <laughs> excited we just bought our first house in canada guys okay so i want to be showing you what the inside looks like so happy so as soon as you come inside the house it is a four bedroom um four bedroom house and as soon as you walk into the house come on in welcome we have this beautiful beautiful space here um this is the first part of the house where you can you know have your jackets Canada is cold, that is not news. So this is where you put your jacket, put your dirty shoes, whatever, um, as soon as you walk in, which is enough storage. I love the fact that they put this here. It is a four bedroom. The first room downstairs is this beautiful, beautiful room, guys. It's just big. <laughs> this is so, so, so amazing. The window is giving me life, giving me vibe. Um, here, we're going to be using it as an office since we'll be working from home. So my husband and I will use here as an office. I love the fact that you have this view where you're working, so it doesn't feel like you can't even see people passing. So this is just awesome. Now, the icing on the cake, guys, is the fact that this downstairs room has, ta-da, <laughs> has a bathroom, okay? Toilet and bath, which is just awesome. It's definitely an upgrade. You will not find that in a typical house But the fact that this is here is just awesome and we have you know, just eno enough space for You know, um, whatever convenience you want to do here. It's just it's just amazing and I love it. I love it. Now, what else do I like that same toilet? is our guest toilet so it has another separate door from here which any visitor you have can also use here as the guest toilet without going through the door it's just amazing love it okay come on in um let me show you guys how living room <laughs> this is the living space it's awesome i love the layout guys see house is all about layouts okay Layout, layout, layout. The layout here is awesome. but not now because money you know money is the problem <laughs> this is the dining this is gonna be the dining space i cannot wait to see how this whole space is gonna turn out when we eventually decorate now what is a house without an island this is giving me vibe this is vibe i cannot count how many breakfasts we are going to be having in this house and i cannot wait to have all those sweet memories built in here, okay? And <laughs> da, 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 is the double fridge. I love it, guys. The fact that one can just let me show you something. You don't have to be buying water anymore. So you want water, you press water, you get water. You want ice. You press ice, wait for it, you get ice. <laughs> Love it. You want crush ice, you get crush ice. It's just amazing. We've been buying bottled water since we moved to Canada because, man, I've not been able to like drink myself to drink the normal water. But with this here, I know that it has this um, feature where the water is already fitted. So, very comfortable to drink that, of course. So, 
See, another thing I love about this kitchen, guys, is storage, storage, storage. Storage here, storage here, storage here, storage here. So much storage, guys. Like, I don't know how many, how many, um, no matter how many utensils, kitchen utensils you have, there's enough storage. There's even storage here, which is just awesome, you know. And they built in the trash here, you know. It's just for us to now put like those trash bag and you know have your trash closed without it smelling out and all of that because the kitchen is in the living room right and this is where we'll be doing all our dishes um i love this double sink in here it's amazing and this window as well you can see what's going on outside that's the backyard um i'll show you guys that later and then down here we have our dishwasher which is going to be saving us a lot of stress of course um considering the fact that we have kids this will really do us a lot of good just load it and then save yourself those energy all right what is a kitchen without a cooking gas right this is just amazing it's a gas not electricity so this is what we have here we have that here yep okay we can even like do a lot you can bake you can air fry you can you know it's just the vibe imagine how many thanksgiving turkey that's gonna be coming out of this place i can't wait to view these memories guys so i'm super excited we have this obviously to just suck out hair from you know the place and make your house smell good even though you're cooking take out all that you know which is awesome i love that this is here See, lightning is everything. The amount of lights in this place, guys, you don't even need to like add any other extra lights. Just imagine this beauty, okay? Just imagine this beauty down here. I love it. I love that light in the dining area. As soon as you put your dining table, it's just going to be direct on your food, which is awesome. But the icing on the cake is this spice kitchen, okay? This place that you can put all your it's the pantry now, it's also a spice kitchen. Okay, I can do the work. So, welcome to the pantry. Okay, this is where I'm going to be loading all my gari, my beans, my my brother just told me it's not spice kitchen, that is actually a pantry. <laughs> okay, so welcome to our pantry. All my good books to go that I have, my air fryer, pots, counted rice, beans, gari, amala, pando, here. It's just they know they got it there's nothing else i'll add here it's just amazing beautiful and then here is where it leads it to the backyard um so if you park the car at the back you can add your jackets i love this beautiful space here that's what i'm talking about and this beautiful details on the floor is just amazing as well they've put in this thing where you can also like see outside is the blind but the blind is inside which is awesome um this is the door to the backyard it's snowy outside <laughs> and they've actually added a patio for us down here it's just for us to now um build our garage and put a fence when we are ready beautiful beautiful love it okay what's next upstairs let's go oh this door here leads to the basement okay the basement is not completed yet we intend to develop it work is already ongoing so can't wait to see what that turns out to be it's a one bedroom basement downstairs all right let's go to upstairs so going to put you know just i don't know what i'm going to do but i'm definitely not going to use blinds here i'm probably going to put those decorative 
um, details that will make it look like frames which I can't wait, I can't wait but I'll show you what it looks like so welcome to the living area upstairs so this is a bonus room that we have here which will be like a family private living area okay the one downstairs is where visitors will be but here will be like something more intimate for us as a family i tend to put a tv a nice lounging couch here um yep yeah, that's what i tend to do so i told you in the beginning that this is a four bedroom one bedroom downstairs three bedroom up here this is the first room which my kids will be using it's just you know canada house for you nothing too fancy not too big but i love the fact that they put this window here which is enough you know the view to see the outside i'm probably going to do his and hers since i have a boy and a girl and then i can put you know their clothes here and all of that i love the fact that they actually put um cabinets sorry storage inside closet okay i don't know why i don't know the names of this thing so it's a closet i love the fact that you put a closet here thank you cameraman you should really consider your job because <laughs> you are good at this this is second room so i'm going to be using one room for myself it has always been my dream to have a room that is just you know like a, a woman cave you know it's just your thing you can make it pink you can make it whatever you want so i'm going to redesign this room i'm going to be needing a lot more cabinet because i want all my handbags to be hanged and all of that i walk in here i feel like this is me that's what i'm going to do with this room it belongs to me so here they also put another um storage here which we'll be using for i don't know maybe every other stuff that you just want to put away and you don't want people to be seeing it in order to just avoid having tacky area this would do a lot of good i love it all right i love it and this is the second bathroom guys see the camera camera man is dodging he doesn't want his face to show you can show your face now we'll pay you premium so this is the second um toilet uh, that the kids will be using I love it. I love all the features that they've put in here. Um, my camera man will show you properly. <laughs> and um, up here, what do I have here? Here. So up here we have the laundry, guys. <laughs> the laundry area. We've got our washer and dryer here. Ah, uh, this would. This is just awesome because. You don't have to go all the way downstairs to do laundry since most of your clothing and all of that will be upstairs anyway i like that this is awesome you can put all the uh, uh washers here you can put your liquid soap you know all those things that you use for laundry just pack them here <laughs> excuse me i'm actually having a bit of cold that's why my voice sounds funny so the last room but not the least Tana is master's bedroom so here we have double windows i love it the view outside i cannot wait to see what it looks like in summer when is it when everywhere is green it's much more bigger than the two other rooms and they also put in a walk-in closet here which is awesome um this is definitely going to be my husband's wardrobe he has already claimed it and I'm not gonna fight him since I took a whole room, so I lost that right. And this is our ensued bathroom. <laughs> it 
enough space, nice light, enough storage to put, you know, every other shower, whatever that you want to put here. I love it. I love it. We got a shower. We got a bathtub. <sighs> what can I? What else can I actually wish for in this house? I love everything. I'm super excited um that god has blessed us with this place and i cannot wait to decorate and show you guys what it looks like at the end i hope you enjoyed the video and until next time thank you for tuning in bye this is the neighborhood these houses are still in construction and that is ours. That is Obi trying to remove our trash can. <laughs> City of Kagri just brought our trash can. So, yep. I'm super excited, guys. Okay, it's still a very new area. So, you can see walk is ongoing over there. Somebody is working down there, so yeah. It's still, I'm sure they are going to like put some. Cause this is the main street. They're going to put some flowers in the summer, you know. Say hi. Hello. He does not like to show my videos, so today is an exception. <laughs> He's running into the car. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs>